radio personalities has died. Wanda Smith was a staple on V103 for years, talking with Atlanta celebrities and hosting fundraisers wherever there was a need in the community. Fox 5's Andrew Lee Proctor sat down with Wanda's radio co-host, Frank Ski, to talk about her amazing life. Frank Ski says Wanda Smith wore a whole lot of hats here in Metro Atlanta. She was a radio personality, a comedian, a mother, but perhaps her most notable contribution was that of giver. We love you. Thank you, I love y'all. <laughs> she was the hilarious sidekick and work wife of Atlanta radio legend Frank Ski, but 58-year-old comedian Wanda Smith forged an identity of her own. Ski says even he was stunned when he got the news. It hit me pretty bad. It hit me pretty bad. I, I heard um, that she wasn't doing well. Um, she was a very private person, and I never expected that. I, I never expected that. It was, it was tough. Frank and Wanda had a different type of job. They rubbed shoulders with all of the celebrities. They traveled the world together, Dubai, China, South Africa, and spent more time together than apart. While we were on the air, it was almost like a husband and wife thing. You know, it was almost like a husband and wife. Like she was my real, for real, at work wife. I mean, she looked out for me like that. Our families were close like that. We knew everything about each other like that. Um, we just lived in two different houses. Smith was part of the award-winning Frank and Wanda show on Monster Station V103 for more than a decade. But he says she will be remembered most for her huge heart. She will go down in the history of Atlanta as one of the biggest givers the city has ever seen. I don't know another woman outside of Elizabeth Omalami that has given more than Wanda. She really was engaged in the situation and knew what they really needed. And sometimes it wasn't money. Ski would not comment on Smith's cause of death. He says she wanted to keep that private. She was so private that myself, Ricky Smiley and others wanted to do a fundraiser for her and she shut it down. She would not let us do it. With this illness recently this year? Yeah. Wow. She, she didn't want people to know. Wanda was still living here in Atlanta. She is survived by her two sons and her grandchildren. In Atlanta, Angelique Proctor, Fox 5 News. Hello, and thank you for joining me here on InquisitiveWomenTV.com. I'm Lady Carla. So it, um, it's real. Um, when I lived in Atlanta, I can recall going to work and our school every morning and you couldn't help but turn on V103. And listening to them, Frank and Wanda, you could tell that they were very close. And just to know, since I moved away, how things have changed. People have passed on um, in the entertainment industry. It's a bit sad, but it's, it's life. And God knows our time and he knows our destiny. So we pray for the family of Wanda Smith. We pray for a co-host, Frank, who worked with her. According to the Atlantic Post, comedian radio personality, Wanda Smith passed away. She was only 58 years old. A cause of death is not yet known. Now, I read other articles. Um, uh, a couple of them had mentioned what she had passed away of. But out of respect, because Frank said that she wanted it to be private. I'm not going to repeat the cause of death. You'll have to do the research on your own. And so she um, was in a, a Miami native known for Atlanta, known in Atlanta for hosting Frank and Wanda in the morning. She hosted the morning show from 1998 to 2012. She spent four years with Ryan Cameron from 2014 through early 2018. Then she would rejoin Frank Ski again for another stint at V103. She also received writing 
credits from Deaf Comedy Jam. She also made appearances in films like Medea Goes to Jail, Medea's Witness Protection, and The Drone That Saved Christmas. VO3's Instagram account Morris Lies to Her Life are saying, Our hearts are weighing heavier today as we grieve the loss of our beloved Wanda Smith. Someone will always someone who always made us smile and who was a big part of V103 for years. We extend our deepest prayers and condolences to her family. And so um, I just want to say she uh, allegedly she died one day after her birthday. So thank God for such a wonderful life. And she was a blessing to give laughter to souls who listened to V103 in the morning. And I can recall, you know, just listening to she and Frank, um, just there to entertain and make people laugh and feel good. And yes, she's going to be missed. So my prayers are not only to Frank and his family because he said their families were close, but also to Wanda Smith's kids and her entire family. May she rest in peace and God loved her best. I'm Lady Carla. Thank you for joining me here on InquisitiveWomenTV.com and I'll talk to you next time. God bless.